deteriorating roads right outside of Milton and people want answers. Good evening, I'm Charlie Sakaitis. And I'm Mallory Metzner. Welcome to our News at 11. We begin tonight with safety concerns on a major roadway. Del Dot says Cave Neck Road is on the list for a little tender love and care after the damage that was caused by recent storms. Coast TV News reporter Charles Reiner shows us how bad that damage is and why locals say it needs to be fixed sooner than later. Gravel and sand. That's really all that's holding this part of Cave Neck Road together. And that's the way it's going to stay, for now. All of Milton is concerned. According to Del Dot, the roadway took a beating during storms earlier this month. And since then, the roadway has looked more like a lake after any time it rains. Dan Along says it's a problem. Um, I have a son that lives down the street, and even he says he has a lot of doctor appointments. And they come into town and go Route 5 because after a big rain because they're not sure, you know, whether they're going to make it across that road or not. Some online have gone as far as saying there's a sinkhole there, though Coast TV has not confirmed that to be true. But the question is when? And Long says it can't happen soon enough. This street from 730 to 830 is like bumper to bumper in front of my house on Atlantic Street. So those Hundreds of people that come to work in Milton every day must be concerned because that's going to cut a lot of time if that road's not. There are more dark clouds heading our way later this week. And we're getting a lot of rain coming in the, in the forecast. And with no fix yet in place, drivers in Milton have a sinking feeling about Cave Neck Road. According to Del Dot, they're still figuring out the logistics of how this is going to get fixed, so there's no set time on when construction could begin, though we will keep you posted when a date becomes available. I'm Charles Reiner in Milton, Coast TV News.